Hong Kong police have been accused of torture by Amnesty International. The human rights group issued a report on Friday with their conclusions from a field investigation into the months-long protests. In a statement, they said Hong Kong's security forces had, quote, an apparent thirst for retaliation and were engaged in a disturbing pattern of reckless and unlawful acts. They said, quote, this has included arbitrary arrests and retaliatory violence against arrested persons in custody, some of which has amounted to torture. Amnesty said retaliatory acts included one instance of shining lasers into the eyes of detainees, a tactic used by many protesters on the streets against the police. Responding to the report, Hong Kong police say they have respected the privacy, dignity and rights of those in custody and have used the minimum force necessary. Over the summer, demonstrators have lit fires across the city. They stormed and ransacked the Legislative Council and have thrown petrol bombs at police. Police have responded with tear gas, water cannons and fired off live rounds into the air. As another week draws to an end, many are expecting further clashes in the embattled city. The legislation that ignited the violence has now been withdrawn, but the protesters have five demands and say they won't stop until all are met.